Can you hear her bubbling? I don't know why she's bubbling because she's not carbonated. Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I am filming an emergency video completely unplanned because I just came across something life-changing. For those of you who don't know, I am a very recent hardcore Sydney Sweeney convert. I've said a lot of things in the past, a lot of things that I regret, a lot of things that I feel that I have made proper amends for online in a podcast, link in bio below. But back when I was young, naive, ignorant and idiot, I didn't see everything that she had to offer. But Miss Sydney Sweeney, Miss Sydney Manise Sweeney, is an icon, a legend, a star, wise beyond her years, a renaissance woman, a woman of many talents, a woman of impressive physical vigor, and just impressive physical presence. Like her body's literally insane. I'm gonna go out on a limb, never have we ever seen such range in performances for an actress of 26 years of age. Euphoria, reality, immaculate, everything sucks, white, lotus, anyone but you? Who can do all of that? Who can do all of that? But Sydney Sweeney. She's also kind of like the queen of advertising. I can't get in a subway carriage without seeing her beautiful, stunning, flawless face. And I wouldn't want it any other way. But recently, she partnered with Bai, who make- I actually don't really know what their products are. Oh, it says, it's Wonder Water. And honestly, it is. I've been a little Bai girly for a while, and I really wish that was a pun. I really wish I could commit to the bit and say that that was a pun. But no, I've, I've been like a big fan of the water brand. I've actually been made fun of for being a big fan of the water brand, because I think it is for a lot of chronically dehydrated patients that this water brand gets recommended, that I drink it of my own volition. My favorite, the clementine flavor. But it turns out that I'm not the only fan of the byproduct. Turns out it's not only me, but also Sydney Sweeney. Sydney Sweeney has recently collabed with them and made Raspberry Lemonade by Sydney Sweeney. The second I found out this was on the market, I said I need to get my hands on it. Not only to further make amends, but also just to try it out. Raspberry Lemonade, are you kidding? Baby girl, you're ticking all the right boxes. This is incredibly hard to find. My friend Ben, who actually told me about this, so thank you so much, was able to find it somewhere in Pennsylvania, but when I was in Kansas for spring break, no stores had it. Came back to New York, Googled it, allegedly no stores in New York, Manhattan, or Brooklyn sold Bye Bye Miss Sydney Sweeney. And I was livid. I said, this is the city where dreams are made. If you can make it here, you can make it anywhere. So you're telling me Sydney can't make it here? What do you mean? Until I walked to my local family dollar, potentially 11 paces away from my apartment, turned around, saw three Bye Bye Sydney Sweeney. And did I buy all three? Absolutely I did. So that was incredibly bold because who knows what it tastes like. Surely it tastes immaculate. At first glance, it looks lovely. On the front, we've got a lime, a lemon, and a raspberry. Three of them, incredible flavor profile. Plus, you've got Sydney holding it with pride, beaming with pride and adoration, as she should, because this could be the collab of a lifetime. She's also wearing yellow, so I pivoted immediately before this video and put on yellow, because I'm not ashamed to admit that I've been incredibly influenced by Miss Sweeney. Anything she does, I do. If that dietitian claiming to have everything she ate in a week wasn't completely debunked, I'd probably be eating that every day of my life. But alas, all I know she actually does like is buy and mac and cheese. I'm nervous, because I've really talked it up and talked her up as she should be talked up. No regrets there. It's antioxidant infused, there are no artificial sweeteners, because Sydney's sweet enough as is. And electrolytes. Let's dive in. <sighs> nice crisp open. Oh, get a load of that. Oh, she's so good. What? A heavy on the artificial raspberry. She tastes like a lolly melted, like a melted red frog. For you Australians out there, and for everyone else, kind of like jelly, like red jelly, red jelly, but in liquid form with a hint of lemon, just to refresh you, to take the edge off, to stop it from being too intense. I have only had one sip, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna take another to be sure. Yeah, no, she kills. Particularly like a punching aftertaste of lolly. Kind of lemon forward, but then soothes that acidity with that lovely sweet lolly. Sydney, this is how you get kids to drink water. Make it taste like Sydney Sweeney, or make it taste like candy. I just spilled a bunch on my leg. Are you serious? There are only three of these in existence in New York. Smells really good though, so no regrets. Um, I'm gonna rate this. I'm gonna rate it a nine out of 10. Who cares? It's my YouTube channel, I can do what I want. I'm gonna rate it a nine out of 10. Sydney, thank you so much for opening my world. 
And that's all I have for you because I was supposed to leave the house 10 minutes ago. Um, if you enjoyed this video and if you love Sydney Sweetie, then please thumbs up and subscribe. And if you don't, I don't want you anywhere near my channel, you hater. And I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye. If you're on that subway, I might end your life. <laughs>